um, with creating a world with all abilities, I think that for me, that means everyone, uh, regardless of their um, ability and what they cannot, can and cannot do, um, that everyone is just accepted in, in the world and, you know, sure you might have limitations but there'll be you know those are there's always um different adaptations that you can do to accommodate for those things and i just think having a just having a just more kind of accepting world of everybody so a couple of times like i um you know i like to like i'll pack my lunch and bring it with me and you know i have there's always a couple of individuals that around lunchtime will ask me oh you know like Greg did you what did you bring for lunch and usually you know I'll answer them with like uh, you know chips and sandwich and you know some water and whatever I have that I packed and you know a couple times they've asked me like oh like uh, you know does your wife um, does your wife pack your sandwich and make your lunch for you and I'm like oh sometimes you know if I forget or if I'm in a hurry um, she'll she'll do that for me and uh, the one day you know I was asked I what I had for lunch I I didn't know and so one of the individuals goes oh your wife must have packed it didn't she because you don't know huh? and I'm like I you're right she did you're right she did like you got me there so um, that, that's just one of a, one of my favorite stories um, but I, I mean I have many um, a lot of stories um, just from working here. So um, it's been a lot of fun. I think my hope for the future is just to kind of keep building on what I would um, imagine has been doing um, over these last like years. And, you know, I know with COVID it was, it was tough, but, um, you know, I think just to kind of keep building on growing growing the, I guess, awareness of, you know, people with uh, disabilities and just having that more awareness and accepted, like people accepting of, of everybody.